he's not going to bring people along with him. Mm. What brings the public along with a candidate is when you have more jobs, like blacks did under the Trump administration, than ever in history. Women having more jobs, Chinese, minorities having more jobs. You know what? I think Americans are like, they're, 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 in, they're sensitive to the fact that they're trying to sell themselves to them, and they're not buying it anymore. Look, the president has spent the last two weeks out on the road, and guess what happened? His numbers went down. So you can tell that what this administration is going to do is they're going to keep him in the White House, and they can't keep doing that. But this guy made a promise in 2020. He said, I'm going to be the adult in the room. I'm going to restore America's to its moral standing. I'm going to make a historic role, Americans' historic role, as a safe haven. Well, what do we have? What we have is 5 million illegals plus 1 million gotaways, so much for making America a safe haven, restoring our moral standing after Afghanistan. What we saw there is an embarrassment. And the truth is that he comes out today, he has a press conference on air travel. Nobody cares, Joe. <laughs> and you know what he says at the press conference? He says, and he says, Pete Buttigieg, I want to compliment him on his leadership. And in the interview with MSNBC, he says Kamala is doing a really, really good job. You're full of crap. Everybody knows you're full of crap. They're not buying it anymore. There you go. You know